advised. Hey everyone, welcome back to Board Games Unlocked, and Devin and I are continuing the Madara series. Uh, we are in, uh, surprisingly, uh, still the side quest uh, to kill some cave sickles. Uh, I think we just got distracted. <laughs> yeah, like, pretty much. We're just like, water pit. Look, you got it. it. <laughs> Another path. All right, let's see what happens there. Yeah. So, we are now in the dank grotto. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You drop down into a secluded cavern, splashing into the water below. You carefully avoid landing on the sharp rocks jittering the cave floor and take in your surroundings before you can get your bearings. You are ambushed by water loas. <coughs> so, we need to end uh, our turn, or uh, yeah, we need to end our turn on the blue exit. Um, oh my god, this doesn't end. There's another fucking thing after this. This is still the side quest. We better get some shit. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we are ambushed. Uh, so this is kind of in the discussion. I was talking about special encounter rules. When the uh, encounter cards got set up, <clears throat> wherever the water lowers were, she, they, they went ahead one. Um, <clears throat> and Rook still has the bug bomb. So yeah. So Zeke is first, eh? <clears throat> still has boy. still has his longbow. True with Unfortunately, bird. I did not anticipate um, uh, all of this. All the water loas, so I wouldn't have probably just ran through <laughs> my. Yep, I thought it was just gonna be some cool stuff. So, <clears throat> the first thing I'm gonna do is actually this might be pretty good. Oh, man, maybe. Water low is because they have this whole room to just because they are not affected by water, so they can just swim through it, and mm -hmm. we're gonna be like, <gasps> yeah. just running through. So I think I'm actually gonna drink this motherfucking fortitude. Motherfucking fortitude. To get an SP. I'm gonna stand there, and I'm gonna shoot that okay. uh, that red one okay, with shoot my red one. I get plus one to my attack because I am not e moving. Some wow. good rolls. Hell yeah. yeah. There's an 11 to their 9, so that's going to be 2 damage. Nice. Plus 1 will be 3 damage. Nice, nice. Um, <clears throat> so 3 damage to the red one. Then, man, yeah, that uh, that arcane sucks. Mm -hmm. What's their elusive again? Oh, they don't make break attacks. Um, uh, so I'm going to shoot again. Second attack. Ah, that is Oof. way worse. Can you hear rolls? Nope. Nope. Not even those arrows? What do those arrows do? They give me plus one to range, and I can exhaust it so they can't dodge. Oh, okay. Um, I'm going to do my fight drive. Okay. So, third attack. I was hoping to get all three attacks there. There hey. we go. All right, 12. So, that'll be uh, four damage. <coughs> three, four. Okay. 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 Decent, decent. Okay, Not okay. Too wait, wait, wait. Now the ambush! <laughs> the ambush! Zeke was ready, had three arrows knocked as he jumped down. So, yep, number one. Um, Hit me, baby. Is there a figure with an SOI? Nope. Is there more than one opponent adjacent? Nope. Is there an opponent with an <clears throat> SOI? Yes. Rook. So, spell six. They have a casting. Ten. So his conviction. <laughs> so. I have two white now. Ooh. So just you gotta get ten. Higher than a ten, or ten or higher. Yeah. It's nice. nice. Okay, nothing. So that was that. Uh, so the purple. Is there an, one? At least, uh, is there more than one opponent adjacent? No, there is only just the one. So then, once again, she's gonna shoot a water ball at you, and that will be an eleven. An eleven. <coughs> okay. Oh, prioritizing the opponent with the lowest. Con oh, I think it's still him. Okay. Ten. Okay. You were taking three <coughs> damage. Three? Yeah, because it's it's two plus the difference. So since you got a ten. Uh, it's one plus the two. Gross. How dare they fucking damage me. Rook, god damn it. Okay, yeah, Rook's turn. Remy is just like... Here. Oh, neat. Uh, to Nightingale. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alrighty, I'm gonna hit her with a hammer. Empower... Well, empowering does no good. Literally not a thing. Yep. Uh, hammer time. 
Eleven. Eleven. All right, yeah, two damage. Two damage. You just got a nickel and dime him. Right. Uh, so that was two. That's going to be it. I guess I'll save up in case I need a dodge. Yeah. yeah. Um, but I, can, I, I can't dodge those spells, though, right? Nope. Nope, you can only dodge. Uh, yeah, because you add defense to the roll, and that's not, you know, it's not defense there. Okay. Uh, you're in water anyway, so you can't dodge in water. Hmm. That's, well, I guess I could move up there and get in people's way. What are you doing with those two? Are you trying to keep onto the... I'm trying to keep up on them. I'm going to try and... Uh, I mean, if we can't dodge anyway, I might as well get out of her way. That'll be a break attack. Oh, fuck me. Stupid break attacks. All right, <clears> I'll... <throat> I could drink a motherfucking fortitude and just hit her again. Yeah, we got a nickel and dime. I'm, yep. I'm drinking, I bought a bunch of motherfucking 42s. <laughs> bought a bunch of those motherfucking things. <laughs> you all <just> drinking beers. <laughs> right. <laughs> We're ready to whoop your ass. Okay, <laughs> so I'll spin the two, attack again. Get her. Get her. Ah, yes. Yeah, three damage. Yeah, I'll take three it. Three dog. Ow! Oh. Yeah. All right. We got Nightingale's turn, so... <laughs> Uh, yeah, we are going to Gore Shot. Let's focus. I mean, they're about the same damage, but I'm going to Gore Shot the red one. And I'm going to Exhaust the Magic Staff, spending a st uh, stamina to deal seven Damn. points of damage. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, it's dead. Which one? The red one. Boom! <clears throat> Five. It's fucking blasted its bitch ass. Right? <laughs> It's like your staff starts to glow, but then it turns to red. It's like, <laughs> it's just overkill. Oh, God. Um, that's actually before the target of one of your It's like you hurt it so bad, you turned it human so it could bleed to death. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't target her with the gore shot, because this is before the target of the of my spell. Wow. So Yeah, that is nasty. Yep, so that is... Uh, well, I can move, at least. So... Uh, one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, yeah, we'll spend that too. Move. Okay. So that was everyone's turn. Okay. Yeah. All right. So they have five. Oh, they have twelve health too and nine defense. Okay. Wow, Nightingale. Hey. Water lower. <coughs> Zeke. Okay. So Nightingale is going to get her three. Yeah, that, that magic staff ability almost seems like it needs to be like a once per encounter thing. Yeah, it's pretty but. fucking <clears throat> OP. Okay, yeah, going to spend a stamina point and then whoop. All right, two. two. So then we'll do the crewer <clears throat> shot. So it's a conviction of nine. They have pretty high conviction, so... Yeah, ten. So it's not going hit, to get hit by my gore shot, but it will still take the two damage. Pew, pew. Um, and then yeah, I will attack with my magic staff. To whop it? I try. I'm gonna not. <laughs> I'm gonna not <laughs> do anything. Do you have the reroll? Oh, I do have the reroll. You are correct. Ha! Ah, yes. Let's try that again. There hey. we go. All right. So that's seven. Uh, so that's 13, so that's 4 damage. And it does magic damage? I, you can't use books, or you can't use symbols. At all, yeah. yeah. Okay, wow. So, yeah, 13, so 4 damage. Nice. So 3. Nickel and dime. Oh, it's dead. Oh, nice. <laughs> so it's just like, fucking blasted another game. Over. Right, <laughs> right in the back of the head, just like punched, fucking George. It's watery. The, made the water head. lowest talk about the, uh, the rabbits. <laughs> all right. Eight. Uh, okay. Well, that was nice. Fucking made mincemeat out of those bitches. <laughs> yeah, it almost kind of seems like if they ever, if we go first, we tend to do well. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, Zeke's turn then. So he has one, two, three. We have extra movement. So unfortunately, it's super slow. So <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Seven, eight. Okay. There's his turn. Okay. Oh, shit. I saw that. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> Ambush! Right. 
Probably. It's a mecha water. In the oh, wow. far corner of the cavern, a small passage leads further down into the cave. Oh Place the blue exit token on the space this totem occupied. From the depths of the passage, a cave sickle scurries onto the rocky platform. Spawn a cave sickle on the blue exit token. One cave sickle. One cave sickle. It's gonna be the red one. Do the red one. Cause yeah, grab the. <clears throat> yep. Put it on the board. I'll do that one. Yep. And there's the blue exit right there, and it literally spawns on that. <laughs> Which... Is that going to be the fucking... Probably the nest. Right. Yeah, I mean, we, we just have to get onto the exit. Yeah. Uh, so, now this thing's going to go... I think it's going to go one, two, three, and then they'll shoot me. Bam! For range of four. Range of four, it's only one little buddy! Well, it doesn't hit he me. <laughs> fails to strike ye. Yay. It goes wide. Okay. Rook. <clears throat> Rick. Throw the pick, Rick. Mm, okay, I guess I cap out. No, wait. I, I think I just refilled it. Uh, yeah, I had done the motherfucking fortitude, so I did not. Hell so yeah, yeah, you did. Okay. It eight. It's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, seven, eight, and nine. <clears throat> All right. Wonder what's over there at the red. Oh, uh, here's a reroll. Nice. Nice. Wham! Ooh, they're actually going first. <clears throat> all right. Man, Remy's mobility would be nice right now. Right it now. certainly would. Yeah. All right. Uh, cave sickle. <laughs> An eight. Within range four. Yes. So he's going to range attack you. He's going to try. That will just, just hit. hit. Yep. For three overflow damage. All right, and I can't dodge, so that puts me at ten. Okay. I can't dodge in water. Oh, I think it runs up on me then, doesn't it? It will. And he has full movement, so then, yeah. yep, and now this is his poison attack. <clears throat> Force nine, seven, eleven. Ew. Ew. Uh, yeah. I mean, unfortunately, I cannot dodge Gross. while I'm in there, so. Uh, how much damage? Okay, so it's 11, um, and then he's got three shields, so that's going to be four damage. Cool, I'm at six. <laughs> uh, that was a melee attack, so you're... Oh, yeah, you're right. So, okay, cool. Yeah, pass it, reduce physical damage, dealt to you. All right, and then I have to resist his poison. Yeah, it's a four seven. How does that work? Does he roll one? No, no, no. I roll, uh, conviction. Oh, force nine. I have to roll conviction and be the nine, otherwise become poisoned. Eight. You didn't give me a re-roll. I gave it to her. Because you're <clears throat> selfish. I, um, I can yeah. give you a re-roll with his Ethereum contour. I mean, I don't know what poison does. I mean, it's probably that skull. No, it may not be. Is it poison? It's poison. Oh, okay. Uh, you are dealt a purple of irreducible damage. Just right now? Yeah. I mean, <clears throat> I can let you re-roll. It's a once per encounter. Oh well, we'll probably finish this encounter soon. Yeah, so, so go ahead and take it. Re-roll that. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. All right. Well, uh, purple of irreducible damage. Yes, sir. Oh okay. Hey, well, keeping up the two. It's because I'm used to smoking, so I'm like I'm kind of poisoning myself. Right. right. So I have re innate resistance to it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nightingale's turn. One, two, three. Let's do once per encounter. Give her two. Okay. And everyone else one. Hey. <clears throat> and then, yeah, that becomes readied. Uh, so she is going to move. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, so six. Collecting the treasure chest. Um. Oh, actually, yeah, she is adjacent to it, isn't mm -hmm. she? Yeah. So let's see what that's about. We'll have her pick that up. It was gonna be a. Uh, it was gonna be old Zeke boy, but he decided to get ganked. <clears throat> you find a pile of treasure. The party gains twenty gold. Behind. Oh God. <clears throat> Behind you, water splashes. You turn with your weapon drawn, afraid you'll find more water lows. However, you don't see anything. You shrug and pocket the loot. Well, isn't that uh, <laughs> ominous? 
It's like this giant fucking worm thing. <laughs> yeah, it's a purple worm from yeah. D&D. &D. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, good! It's a Hogradar or whatever. Oh, God. Okay. Just... Uh, yep, so that is now gone. Cash money in my pocket. Got the cash. Ca All right, Rook's turn. Nick. All right, do we want to look at that? Or do we want to bother? Might be treasure, might be enemies. Oh, <clears throat> I say we just get on out. Just go on and, I mean, I don't know if it'll be worth it, but. I mean, just uh, who has to make it to the exit? Just anyone. An adventurer not just turn on the blue exit. Not just Bug Bomb Guy then? Yeah, no. So anybody? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yes, one, so it's, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, see here, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. If I can get over there before you're done, then. Okay. All right, Zeke's turn. <clears throat> he is going to re-quip for free, pulling out his swords. Okay. Uh, then he's going to attack uh, that <clears throat> thing, so it's going to be, yeah, oh, it's actually two purples. No, it's, it's purple and white, because they have finesse. Wow. All right, he missed. Oh, I totally gave you a reroll token before. <laughs> oh, well, then I'll spend it. Yeah. I'm like, quit giving it to her. <laughs> well, I just think her magic against the water level Well, she, is, only, but... she already has one, first of all. Okay. No, that's what I meant for him. Oh. Yes, that, that's what I was saying. <laughs> oh, my God. Oof. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, well, I'll do blade works. Hey. And attack again. A lot of shitty rolls. Yep. Um, my favorite part of human history is when we uh, <laughs> crucified Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, oh, uh, oh, it has to be a ranged attack. What? For your oh, yes. crank up. All right, I shall attack again. There, there we it go. Is, and it is very dead. 12, that is whatever it's over. Um, there, so four over four, uh, five, six. Yeah, six damage. It's hey, you get a treasure. I certainly do. Six. <clears throat> Spent literally everything to do that. Okay. But it's now dead. So now we got to hurry up because if we finish our turns... I mean, we lose the encounter if we get four of those time tokens. Do they sack over time? No, I don't think oh, okay. so. All right, Zeke, Nightingale, and Rook. Oh, maybe he can get there before I can. I mean, he probably won't, actually, but you never know. Because I'm going to have to move. So this could be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and then 9. So that's his whole turn. Okay. And then Nightingale. Is she going to chill? Uh, I mean, yeah, because she, she can't. Because uh, that'll be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So... Yep, that'll be her entire burn as well. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then seven, eight. And I see it. All right. <clears throat> um, in the back of a tight spot between two rock formations, you see some loot. Spawn the red loot token on the space. This token, this token cool. occupied. The red loot. Mm -hmm. Woo. Oh, no. Yeah, I mean, it's been a little more. Okay. <clears throat> I, mean, uh, I guess I could motherfucking board it. <laughs> uh, you would only be able to move, though. Yeah. Like, so, because you have to spend an SP to pick it up. Right. All right. If Rook doesn't go last, then... Well, he's first, so... Cool. Awesome. <laughs> I find it. Gain 10 gold and one random consumable, then read the hidden text for the blue objective. Oh! Okay. As you grab the loot, a clicking sound echoes through the grotto. The ceiling collapses, forcing you to jump out of the way. Remove your figure from the board, replacing the red loot token with a 1-1 one, one obstructing terrain token. And then place tiles and tokens according to diagram 4. Okay, there's a lot more to that. But it said obstructing terrain, which was um, red. Okay. Hey, throwing knives. Daggers. Daggers. Okay, so you're removed from the board. Oh, shit. 
That gets placed there, <clears throat> according to diagram four. Uh, oh, interesting. Is that what that said? According to, then, yep. Oh, wow. What the fuck did you do, man? Oh, no. What did is you Is it changing do? the whole map for it everybody? It is, well, for you. Oh, okay. So I'm just fucking trapped somewhere. Mm, yep, yeah, like so. Uh, okay, uh, give me another, give me the um, purple. And then the blue objective is there. We have green here. And then green loot um, here. And then. Yep. Oh, God. You are trapped. Oh, uh, oh, my. Pleasure <clears throat> you yeah, for being greedy, I guess. Uh, I told you it wasn't worth it. Yeah. You'll just have to, I guess, uh, show me your bee hole after this. You know, more than you normally do. Right, just a little bit extra. Fuck. He uh, can't jump to save his life. Yeah. And um, make an agility 10 check. So it's, uh, it's two purples plus your agility. Okay. <clears throat> Is it really, really bad? I don't know. I, don't, I didn't read on. I wanted to see. Okay. So um, five, six, seven plus one puts me at eight. I can, if it's super bad, I have a per encounter, re-roll any of my dice. Oh, Okay. Um, oh, discard the blue objective token, sorry. Oh, no, sorry. If you fail, you are crushed by falling rocks and defeated. <laughs> Let me just flip that. Uh, the five's already a pretty good roll on these dice. So we're going to re-roll the fucking two. Hey! All right. Success. Okay. God Jay damn. earrings. You're, uh... Well, you had to flip that, didn't you? Yeah, it's the per encounter. It oh, I see. Oh, I see. Yeah, That's yeah, not yeah. listed on the other one. Okay. If you pass, place your figure on the blue objective token. Ha! Um, while adjacent to the obscuring terrain token, an adventurer may make an encounter action to make a strength 10 check. If they pass, they may discard the obstructing terrain token. Obstructing terrain? Is that what the... Oh, is this obstructing terrain? No, that is... Uh, uh, I fucking... Whatever. Oh, the red's the obstructing terrain. Yes, da that's dangerous terrain. The red's obstructing, so you can break through. Nice. Um, okay. Uh, yeah. Well, I guess I just have to just land on the exit, though, right? Oh, actually, no, because those guys are going to go. So. Okay. So, yeah, Red will, I guess, shoot. Yeah. Sh shoot you. Okay. Because he can't move to right. attack, so it'll just... So he does have one buddy and spear, so it's an orange and a white. Or it's 11. That's a noof. Uh, he has one, two shields. It's one or... over. I have armor enough to just completely... What is your this. armor? It is four. Okay. So they have to do over four damage, so you can hurt me. Yeah. So yeah, deflected! All right. Purple. Purple will attack me. He has a buddy. That's a 12. That's a lot of stuff. <laughs> All right, what's happening here? So that's 12. He's already two over. And then he's got three shields. So he's going to deal with five damage. So I got one damage coming my way. Um, I'm going to... I have not... I cannot dodge, can I? Nope, I don't have stamina enough to dodge. I mean, it's one damage. Right, <laughs> I was just wanting to counter. Oh, I see. Uh... Oh, I see. That was like, I'll have to take it. Alright, I think it attacks again. Okay. 
Fails. Yeah, counter. Yeah. <clears throat> I will. Uh. All right, since this is untapped, I will tap it now. Go ahead, power. And he's gone. Nice. Six, 11, already over by three. One, two, three, two. Yeah, he is obliterated instantly. All right. Kill the guy. Okay, and then... So it was hit my yeah. turn getting over there. Yes, uh, Zeke's turn. So I guess I just have to end on the exit. Yeah, they, I don't they didn't think. add any additional rules. No. Nope. So this character's just trapped and. Yeah. Um, yeah, then discard the blue objective token. So while adjacent to. Yeah, I guess it. It doesn't matter. I mean, there's still an enemy on the board. I can. I mean, I still have to make a ridiculous leap for... It'd be ten, an agility check of 10. Yeah. Because it's only... it's the, the first space is always 10. It's add 2 for each space you jump over. Gotcha. Um, so I guess, uh, yeah, Zeke will just 1, 2, 3. Hmm. And just end on that. Okay. guess it doesn't affect you in any way. But we don't get any reward. Mm -hmm. But we continue to sickles upon sickles. Okay. So, interesting. This uh, turned into a long side quest. Yeah. But that was Dank Grotto, so let's see, hopefully, the conclusion to this. Uh, maybe. This isn't even a side quest anymore. We're continuing the <laughs> story. It's a full quest. Uh, but yeah, uh, stick around for the rest of the series. Other than that, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and have a wonderful whatever time of day it is for you. Hey everyone, thank you for watching and I really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you would like to see more of my content, go ahead and click that subscribe button and the bell to be notified whenever I upload any new content. If you feel like supporting the channel, you can go ahead and click that Patreon link to be taken to my Patreon and any help is truly appreciated. Other than that, stick around for any, any other run-throughs or reviews or cool top tens or whatever I feel like putting on. Other than that, like, comment, share, and subscribe and have a wonderful whatever time of day it is for you.